This is Twit. So you remember uh, Boston Dynamics? This yes. was the company Google bought uh, uh, briefly uh, until they realized that Boston Dynamics was doing robots for the military. Scary robots like this running robot. I think this is the same robot, Atlas, that they showed earlier uh, one of the Boston Dynamics employees kicking, knocking over with a stick. And the robot was so nice and just got up and kept doing things. But I have to think it's kind of making a list, right? Look at it, it can jump. I know, right. like a baby when it does that. Like how yeah, I know, sort it's of cute. Like thinks about it. Would you <laughs> like uh, one of these Boston Dynamics for your very what, own? What I'd like to know is how much range does it, I mean, you know, how much of a battery does that thing have? 90 minutes. 90, that, that that you, that not, not that specific one, but the one they're about to sell, 90 minutes. In 2019, they announced this at TechCrunch Disrupt this week. Boston Dynamics is going to start selling their dog. Oh. Well, this well, is, that's the 90 minute one. Spot Mini. This is a video that they posted on YouTube of it autonomously navigating their office and labs. Now, they had to run it through once to get an image. So the 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 robot, do you really want this in your house? <laughs> They're speeding well, it up see, here. You've seen the other video where it opens the door and, yeah. and then lets you the can other get one, one with a with a through. articulated arm. Yeah. Be perfect for pinching people. Uh the uh, robot, they say it's the quietest robot they've ever made. It's, I mean, I don't know how quiet it is, but it's, it doesn't sound like a steam engine coming at you anyway. No, uh, just give me a canine. Uh, this is autonomous. This is, this is like an autonomous vehicle. This is like the DARPA I'd, Grand Challenge. I'd, I'd, right? I'd rather pick up the dog poop instead of having one of these. Well, Kevin Rose suggested they cover it with fur. I think that's probably, I don't know. I don't know if it'll look like this when they sell it. I don't, I don't know, know how expensive it'll be. They didn't cover the little Sony dog with fur. Yeah, and that, that, yeah but it yeah, looks dog-like. This that's thing true. looks, I don't know. This thing looks scary. like a like a crawler. Yeah. Like like a Well wait till you wait yeah. to see this. You can't get away from it by running upstairs. It's just gonna follow you. <laughs> have, have you seen have you seen the Black Mirror episode, uh, Hard Metal? Or um, not yet. Heavy Metal. Is it the new the new it's from the latest series? Yeah, yeah, no, I'm not caught up yet. I can't wait. I love that show. At least it Talk does stairs dystopia. slowly, so if you run up the stairs, you might be okay. You could run back down. Yeah. And then kick it. it by the, the way, it doesn't go forward downstairs, it goes backwards, just like me. <laughs> so how much is this thing going to cost? They don't say, but they do say they're going to sell it to end users in 2019. I mean... It's mini Spot Mini. This looks expensive. <laughs> it does look really expensive. $10,000 Sounds least, like you know right? about this if you at said least. 90 minutes. Have you, have you talked I, with the people? I was just brushing up before we went on yeah. there. The Google, uh, the Google folks sold this company. They realized it's kind of creepy Owned for Google Soft to Bank own. Now. Yeah, that's what's, what's really interesting. Sun Son, mm -hmm. Masayoshi Sun who has pledged a $100 billion investment in Silicon Valley Tech. $100 billion. He's already spent $30 billion of it. He bought Sprint, mm -hmm. uh, is, a, is a, now the owner <laughs> of these scary robots. He also bought a big chunk of Uber. Did he? Yeah. He bought, uh, He's got money to spend. He bought about 15% of Uber. Is it interesting? I don't really understand where all that money came from. SoftBank was originally a software distributor, I think, right? That's where the name came from. Yep. Owner of Ziff Davis. They bought Ziff Davis, I remember, yeah. I was still working there when the, we, we had to call him Sun Son. Um, <laughs> by the way, that sound, I'm not, I'm not making baseball caps for everybody in the audience. That's the spot mini still running around. <laughs> Does sound like an embroidery machine, though.